Welcome to the PsycInfo thesaurus tutorial. Using a thesaurus is a good way to start your search. Basic keyword searching looks for occurrences of a word anywhere in a document. A thesaurus term is a librarian created tag that describes what the complete article is about. A thesaurus search will often give you better results. We select the thesaurus link. We enter our first search concept, substance abuse, in the browse box. The thesaurus shows us that the subject heading is drug abuse, so we click on that link. We click on the drug abuse link again. The new page displays drug abuse in the context of broader terms, narrower terms, related terms, and the terms for which it is used. We decide drug abuse is the term we want and click the checkbox. If we were combining more than one thesaurus term at this point, we would have to decide whether to combine them using AND, OR, or NOT. AND would find articles with both headings, giving us fewer results, OR would find articles with either heading, giving us more results, and NOT would eliminate articles containing the selected headings. We click the ADD button. The search box shows that we are searching for articles with the descriptor drug abuse. This search gives us 29,576 results. We return to the thesaurus to browse for our second search concept. We type group therapy and browse. The thesaurus term is group psychotherapy, so we select it. We click group psychotherapy to view it in relation to broader, narrower, and related terms. Clicking Explode expands the search to include both group psychotherapy and its narrower terms, in this case encounter group therapy and therapeutic community, giving us more results. Clicking Major Concept reduces our results to only those where group psychotherapy is a significant theme of the articles. We decide not to explode the search or limit results to Major Concept and click the Group Psychotherapy checkbox and click the Add button, and Search. This gives us 15,212 results. We clear the search box, and click the triangle to open the search history, and select the checkbox next to our searches. We click the Search with AND button to combine the two searches and look for only articles with both subject terms. We toggle shut the search history to display our results. We have 258 results. We want to limit our results by age, so we click the link and choose Adolescence and Update. We also choose peer-reviewed refereed to limit our results to academic papers and update. This leaves us with 33 results, a manageable number. We can now explore our results. This ends the PsycInfo thesaurus search tutorial.